Hello everybody, how are you going? And welcome back to Mini Motorways, where this weekly challenge is on Lisbon. I would say one of the hardest maps. So what is it going to be? Get it straight. Diagonal road tiles require double the amount of road tiles. Not a very fun thing. And then only start with one motorway. And would you kindly, holy moly, there is not a single positive thing in there. My goodness, I mean, trees are good for the planet, but not good for options. Either way, at, uh, that's diagonal though. Well, sure, I guess that's just going to have to be what it has to be. In that case, then I guess my blocking up should definitely be vertical, just to try and consume serve as many road tiles as possible. I mean, I would love to do that and love to do this, but uh, it just eats them away. To be honest though, I definitely could have had a worse first spawn. And so regardless of, oh, okay, well, there it is another, not too shabby one. Ah, oh, but uh, it's shabby because I have to then use diagonal road tiles. It's just, I've only got 15 left. All right, well, one week down and that was certainly not the worst start. I definitely have a bundle of road tiles everywhere, but I'll take the 20 and a roundabout because I've already got two traffic lights and I'm not even going to use those. Well then, this is a very slow paced game right now. Like, what's going on? Is it going to spawn any other buildings in? I feel as though some games you have about 10 by now. There we go. Finally, we have another blue or a blue just to match the aesthetics of Lisbon. But there we go. Of course, there's more diagonal road tiles. You can upgrade all you want. I've got the people for this. It's fine. Do that kind of stuff. Stuff. Oh, well, usually I would go by the rule of never prioritizing road tiles because you should have plenty of them by the end, but traffic lights or double road tiles on double diagonal road tiles is definitely going to be the idea. To be honest though, I'm most scared by the fact that I'm yet to get a bridge and I only have one motorway, and this map, maybe besides Manila, but Lisbon for sure and so many of these other ones, Busan, they're all just bridge dense maps. It's just, you need so many just because they spawn white and everyone else just across all the little islands, you need to be able to bridge it. And if you don't have a bridge and I only have one motorway, there's no hope. Ah, yes, okay, that is all right then. At least, I mean, I would love another motorway, but that is never going to happen. And so a bridge it will be. At least now I'm just a little bit prepared for anything it can throw at me, of which I guess if I have a couple more yellow spawning up here, I could swap it around. That is now equal, so I might as well swap it around. Oh, well, that is certainly a very nice orange, but of course the rest of it is also just nice and cleaned up. I mean, the trees are playing a little bit of havoc there as I've used four row tiles to travel that little bit of a distance because I can't go straight through it. But it's all right. I have 65 remaining. I can afford to take anything else that throws at me now. But like I said last time, this has been a very, very relaxing game as, well, I mean, look at that. Another week is down and I would love the road tiles, but I definitely do not need them. I would not need a hundred at only, what is it, like 200 points or so. So roundabout it is not even a hundred 30 points. It feels so slow. Come on, speed it up. Quadruple time. Ah, oh, but yeah, I did just realize that I've had an orange spawn over here, and that means that everyone is now open for business. All of these islands, I mean, honestly, I might even just block this island up before it gets a little bit too ahead of itself. There we go. Exactly where I wanted something to be spawning, because I can actually manage that. I don't want to be spending my one bridge under 200 points. You guys are a little bit too claustrophobic, or a bit too joined together, I think. I've blocked up this island, but there's no way I can block up everything. And now another orange, which is very, very convenient. Also scary because there's three in one little area and that is not what you want. Oh my goodness. And it's also upgrading. Honestly, I think I just have to go ahead and block these guys up because I do not want every single orange to be spawning over here and forcing me to use my one motorway just for them. It's no way. Look at them. They are just doing me dirty. They're spawning in the other little spot. And then now that guy's upgraded as well. I mean, I guess I did. Okay. I've got a few spawning in, but they're not all spawning in perfect locations. I'm just worried about using my one motorway this early. But fear not, I have everything in order, even though it does take up a few road tiles to connect those oranges in, and now a white. That will take quite a few, because like I said, I only have so many, but okay, well, at least I now have another bridge, so that's what I was worried about. And I have the road tiles, because I'll have 55 and 3 bridges, so I can manage that. <sighs> I hadn't realized that that had expanded. Look at it. It's just trying to rid me of my soul. You... <laughs> okay, then. Well, at least once again, it's fairly straight overall. And I've got half the road tiles in already. Look, White, you can continue to do whatever you want to do. You were a nice soul trader down there. Yes, you did take a bridge, but all horizontal, not a drama. Okay, yellow... I can also manage that, especially when I get another bridge. I mean, I'm just dwindling on those road tiles, and so I wish it was traffic lights and road tiles again, but a bridge is always going to be coming in handy when I need to make a mass migration like these guys are. Look at this, straight up through the trees, perfectly spaced, and everyone just gets to have a jolly old time. Oh, oh, that's uh, pushing the limits about how long a road can be. So even though I do have a bundle, and it's fairly horizontal... Oh, wait, hang on a second. You... Uh, 
I guess I actually know I can go like this and I will reserve that space so no one can take it from me. Look at that. These trees are trying to do me in, like I said. Otherwise, I guess I would just have to do something like that because it's like, oh, I need one more row tile. No, I need two more row tiles. One more well, you and you. There we go. Classic white spawn right here. To be honest, it is generally quite convenient, but I just don't think that I'm going to be able to swing it, especially not right now. I don't have the row tiles to be able to go all the way over there unless I was to swap something out for my motorway. And then speaking of, I'm going to need that because I don't, I don't have the road tiles for it. It's just such a give and take. I've used so many for white and at least they're all horizontal, but my goodness, if they weren't, I wouldn't be able to do it. How far can I get? Because, oh, can I get straight to the front door? Oh, of course I can. Oh, that's such a rude little thing. Here we go. I guess you and you can come back to me and that is now, oh, come on, come on. Oh, that's not what I wanted. Whoa, 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 whoa. You were just built up to the maximum. I guess you do only have three, and I do have a whole collection of them down in the middle here, but I only have 12 rotiles, so I think it might be time just to be sending a few more back from whence they came. Oh, 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 it's almost to the point where I just need the rotiles because I'm constantly living on the edge, and virtually all the roads are horizontal as well. I've done pretty darn well, or at least been pretty darn lucky to keep everything as straight as possible, and I'm still running out, and so I can't refuse the bridge though. If unless it's traffic lights, I will take the thing. Oh no, but it's about to be white as well, and I can just feel it Look, oh, is it? Yeah, it just popped off then and there. So I will just disconnect that road and run the motorway in. There you go. Everyone can just go have a whale of a time. Everyone that's already sent can already go as well, but at least that one just won't pop its head off. Um, everyone... I mean, this light blue is still dying, but I think it's more of a travel distance thing than anything else. Surely not. I mean, I'm just hitting a thousand points and I knew this was going to be difficult, but this is just proving to be not ridiculously hard, but just very strange. How are you still fighting? Spawn another building in, for goodness sake. If you were this desperate for volume, spawn another one. I don't care where, right here if you really wanted to. It doesn't matter. Just take some load off this guy. I mean, look, I guess I have a bridge and I have a couple of rotiles, so I can't afford to be connecting people in, but that's just insanity. Oh my good lord. I just rearranged the oranges a little bit, but that is not what I expected just to be changing that around. I didn't expect it to then go ahead and spawn another one in. I, I can't afford that. I have every Actually, I can afford that because I have it all prepped and ready. Here you go. Bing, 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 bing. Down to 17 road tiles, but do I care? Not a care in the world because I can then have plenty more people to spare even though it's very ugly. Uh, yeah. You like that? That should be okay. Ugh. Actually, I'm... Uh, yeah, yeah, sure. Just go like that, I guess. Whoa, holy... Oh, well, at least I finally got some more rotiles because I'm down to my final two and I've just been collecting them as well. But look at this. The absolute push from orange is insane and I'm still dealing with white and that is what it is. Honestly, I guess I can put a roundabout in there. That would probably help. But look, I just went and connected all of these extra guys in and they all just left. And so if I didn't, I, I don't think I would have been surviving very long. I guess I should just go ahead and connect every single one in. I don't have a bridge, but... Uh, yeah, surely. Surely that has to do it. I mean, look how many pibs there are, but surely. If orange doesn't kill me, why definitely are? Because they just can't seem to get their stuff together. It is honestly ridiculous. Light blue as well. It's 1,500 points, and it's been easy up until now. But look, you, how are you dying? What the, what, what, what? No, 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 no. No, you get off there. You guys can all just deal with your own stuff. See, if someone doesn't pull in fast, I'm definitely going to be dying. You pull in, you pull in. Come on, someone else pull in. Oh, no, oh, no. That is going to keep me down. Oh, no, oh, no. How long can I survive this one for? Oh, I don't think this guy's going to get it. Oh, what just spawned in? A blue. Honestly, mate. I just don't care, but sure, you can go ahead and have a few more people, because Orange, I cannot believe that Orange have just done that to me, it's ridiculous, because I can't take the motorway off white, I don't believe, I mean, I could swap a couple of things around, but that wouldn't really help me, I need motorway one back to be shipping these people over faster, I, I mean, I guess if I miraculously survive, I might as well attempt to change it up, but I don't have another bridge, so there's not even any way to do that, uh, no, I think this will be it. Let me just play it very, very slowly and see if I die immediately if this guy picks it up. Oh my goodness, come on, people, come on. Oh, no, these guys are going to cause traffic and just make it so they don't pick it up. Come on, that's going to kill me. Can't won't pick it up fast enough. Holy moly, I am living on the edge. Look, how is that not dead? There are plenty of cars there, and I'm sure I'm just dying somewhere else as well. Uh, blue, yeah, blue, blue, blue. Always problems with blue, isn't there? But I don't have anything to give you guys because it's all in orange and white. Honestly, the other thing that blows my mind is the fact that light blue is dying. Light blue have every single thing connected in that I can possibly give them. They've only spawned so many houses in and they're all connected in via virtually the fastest possible means. I don't have any more bridges. I don't have any more motorways and it's still dying. It's like, what else do you possibly want? Orange on the other hand, 
it's a death trap because they all spawn together and I just can't believe that that piece of toast has survived so far and it still somehow is. If I can get these guys on board, it should be better just off that. But I still need to be making people travel faster and I don't know how. I guess you need to be in there and you can go in there because why not? I need every single one, I think. Every single one. Not not most of them. Every single one. It's utterly insanity. There we go. I believe that is every single orange I can possibly afford to give. And if I can get, I was about to say another motorway, but if I can get another bridge, then maybe I can work something out with white to get some stuff back off them because I can't be swapping it around if I don't have another bridge. It's that simple. But once again, I'm just playing it slowly and my eyes are locked on these guys because I don't know who is going to kill me. If I was betting, I would have thought they would have been this guy, but clearly not. The horse has bolted, but it has not finished yet. Oh, it's going to be this one. Look at it. it. Nobody in sight. Look at that. That is outrageous. It is just so insane when you have to take everyone from one side of the map all the way to the other side. I mean, let me just continue in Endless and see if I can just bug a white off for one moment and not have to worry about their pesky needs. If I can just, I mean, I won't be able to tell because it gets rid of the pips, but my goodness, the amount of volume moving along that road is insane. Come on, give me a bridge, give me something. Come on, hurry it up. There we go, that is all the upgrades that I will possibly need. And let me just take that bridge so I can just dump these whites into where they need to be going. To be honest, I wish that Endless Mode didn't get rid of the big pips. It just stopped you from dying so the big pips could sit there forever as there really isn't any way to know I mean unless it's filling up completely but how dead is it because obviously when you get late game it can fight but not die and still be completely full so you just never know I wish the pip stayed there but it didn't kill you instead of just the little pips staying there regardless though let me just see how or oh, top 15% I mean I knew it was going to be difficult but a score of 1700 is nowhere near good enough to be pushing the top what there is absolutely no way how are you possibly getting 14,000 obviously there's leagues above everyone else that that almost screams of cheating, but I, I feel like someone could do it and I don't know how that is the tree whisperer or something like the trees just divert and control the traffic better than traffic lights ever could I, I don't know how they've done it but clearly that's just insane 